What's up guys, welcome to today's video. Today we're gonna be going over what we're calling the bartender's bob. What that basically means is it's a bob for anybody that wants to pull their hair back uh, when they want to and then they can wear it down when they wanna do that as well. So sectioning for this cut, super simple. We're gonna do this haircut dry because I really wanna see her ends. You saw at the very beginning at the before uh, that her ends are really shattered and weak. So I wanted to get uh, to the strong point of this cut which we'll go over in a second so the sectioning I separate the front and back just behind the ear and then I separate straight down the center back and then we're going to draw a horizontal line right across that occipital bone area to behind the ear and that's where we're going to cut our first cut so I'll section that up we'll do the same thing on the left side and then this is where I want to determine uh, that weakness that happens from that mid shaft to ends. You can see how see-through it is as I get closer to the end. So I'd kind of pull out the section and determine what that length is that I want. And I go in with comb tension and I just hold that down and cut my line using my comb as a guide. Now I'm going to cut a balanced back. If you don't know what a balanced shape is, uh, you should go to shopfse.com and download my FSE digital haircutting system. I'll link it below in the description. Um, but that will give you uh, all the terminology, everything that I use in a haircut. You'll really be able to follow along well uh, once you learn that system. So go download that uh, at shopfse.com. So once we get our baseline cut, now I'm going to start working vertical layering into this haircut. I want to create a ton of texture movement. I want to get into that interior and really uh, remove some of that length so I can get a nice healthy result. So I elevate everything straight out from the head using the below section that we cut at a low elevation as my guideline and then just layering from that. So uh, I'm using a point cutting technique. What that's going to do is it's going to help shatter the ends a little bit. Um, just because I'm trying to make the hair healthy doesn't mean I don't want the texture and the soft edges. Um, so I go in, you'll see me sometimes twist my hand and do a little bit more of a blunt cut, but then I always go through and break that up with point cutting. Uh, also, when you over direct everything straight back, it pushes length to that right side corner. Um, so you saw me go through and after I cut the section, I'll actually lay the hair down and then recut that line in the base. Um, this is just because I don't want too much length going towards the front. And it's also a great way to build up a little extra density with somebody that has fine hair towards the shoulders. So everything I'm bringing back just pushes some length behind the ear. And then I go in and I cut that at a no elevation, kind of low uh, on along the shoulder right here you'll see me cut that corner off that i just created with the haircut using the underneath as a guide so we'll just continue doing that exact same thing uh, bringing everything straight out from the head uh, all the way through the back and then we'll move into the front Now you can see as we finish up the back how healthy it's looking. Um, I just want to continue keeping that line in the back and then also creating a little more texture. So the way that I'm going to texturize the top is I'm going to take a horizontal section across the crown and then pull that up, elevate it straight up in the air and point cut into it just to add a little extra flare texture to the back of the haircut. And now we'll move in to the side of the cut, continuing those horizontal uh, sections um, or horizontal partings in the side. And I'm just going to connect the front and back for a baseline that's going to give me a little bit harder line at the base and then i'm going to elevate everything else from that point so bring everything up in the air use that bottom as a guideline so i know that my length is true and i just hold it up in the air and point cut it all the way through that top section of the haircut 
Now we're going to do the same thing on the left hand side as we did on the right. So a horizontal parting across the back, cut your baseline, get a nice solid baseline in there, and then we'll elevate everything else up and cut that with a point cutting technique to um, get a little bit of texture and add some layering into it. So you can see I just pull everything up across over top of the parting. Uh, this is another key part of this haircut. Make sure you over direct everything over the parting and that will give you a nice balance to the look. Now I'm just going to clean up the fringe, add a little bit of a side fringe to it. Um, if you wanted to do a center center fringe, you could do that as well. Um, but she already had a side fringe and we're going to stick to that. Now we're going to style it, use a little bit of wand iron, uh, add that texture, really show off um, the texture in the cut. You can see how beautiful it looks, how much healthier it looks. Look how you can pull it up. That creates the bartender bob right there. We let it back out. Look at that texture. She's super happy. I hope you guys like it. Let me know in the comments below. Make sure you're asking your questions and uh, I'll see you guys on the next video. Thanks. One last thing before I go, I want to talk to you about the Virtual Cutting Club. The benefits of the Virtual Cutting Club are I get to be your cutting coach. Any questions you have, you can reach right out to me. Also, you get exclusive content. You get access to my FSE digital haircutting system. That's a $50 value. And all of the live stream classes, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, uh, those are exclusive to the Virtual Cutting Club. You can join me on those live streams. You'll get the notification as soon as I go live. So what are you waiting for? Now $9.99 per month, 10 bucks per month, and you get to have me as your cutting coach. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday live classes, exclusive content, and access to everything else I have to offer, and some special discounts along the way for our online store. So hit that subscribe button, become part of the VCC right now, and let's get to work.